What up, what up, what up? It's your boy Moan T and it's time for that five minute cigar review. And it is a beautiful day here in Denver, Colorado, even though we just had a slight small rainstorm roll through, but now it looks like the clouds are gone, the sky is blue, and everything is everything. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, today's special guest is Hoyo by Hoyo de Monterey. And it is a nice little cigar. I'm going to go ahead off the bat, give it three fingers, maybe three and a quarter. Yeah, something like that. Um, nice, solid cigar. Uh, let me tell you what it's got in it right, right quick. The wrapper is Havano. The uh, binder is Ecuadorian Sumatran, and the filler is Nicaraguan, and uh, let's see, USA, Pennsylvania, and Esteli. And it's it's a good solid cigar. Uh, it's nothing spectacular, but it's a good cigar. It's nice and rich. Um, it's listed as a full-bodied cigar. I'd give it medium at best. Um, but you know, again, I smoke enough cigars throughout throughout the week, throughout the day, shit that uh, my palate might just not be as sensitive as it used to be. Because I can tell you, sometimes a lot of the flavors seem to just all run together. But this one, again, it's a nice, rich cigar. Almost no spice. I mean, the other day when I smoked it, towards the end it got a little bit spicy, but through the majority of it, almost nothing there spicy. Um, a little bit of a chocolatiness, chocolatiness to it. Um, but again, the, the flavors are kind of subtle. There's nothing that's just like smacking you in the face, but this is the kind of cigar uh, when you're sitting home and you're just reading your newspaper or a book or watching something, it's a good little cigar to uh, to enjoy your day with. You don't, I'm not pairing this with anything other than water, which by the way, I need to get me a little swig of water. Pardon me. tasty so anyway back to the cigar back to the information back to the review like I said it's like I keep saying a good solid cigar as you can see nice construction there even on the burn the band is a little large sometimes I like the, the large band sometimes I don't um, depends on how the glue is something I almost I don't think I've ever talked about the glue on the band is typically designed that as you get close to smoking there that the heat from the cigar should loosen up that glue and it just peels off sometimes it works sometimes it doesn't the bigger bands though it's just like ah, eh, it's just it's too much although this is not a gaudy band now it has nothing to do with the cigar per se other than the aesthetics of it as you can see I got me a V cut on there the draw is nice and easy mmm but not too easy. A little bit of coffee in there too, if I didn't mention. So you got a little bit of a, uh, a richness, sort of a rich coffee actually, uh, when you think about it, or when you put it all together. Rich and chocolatey and a little bit of coffee. Um, but it, like I said, it's, it's just a good solid cigar. Uh, Hoyo de Monterey is sort of a, the, like most cigars, you have the Cuban versions, and then after the embargo, um, all these companies came out with the same names. And this is a, a good iteration of the Cuban, of the non-Cuban version, I should say. Um, I've had a few of their cigars, and I haven't had anything that I wasn't satisfied with. And this one is uh, no different. Mm. Again, sometimes you just got to take a second, let it sit on your palate. Nice tight little ash. Let it sit on your palate while you in, while you take in all those different flavors or those those few the the ver the variety of flavors I should say whatever whether it's one or two flavors or three or four or five flavors. Um, this one that's when you do that when you really sit it there and hold it, I really that sweetness comes out a little bit more. The sweetness and the and the uh, the coffee comes out a lot more. And that sweetness is that chocolatiness I was talking about. So anyway, not a whole lot more to talk about on this one other than, as I said, I'm going to give it three and a quarter fingers. It's a nice, rich, um, chocolatey, coffee, 
cigar, very little spice on it. Again, as you get towards the end, this little spice comes out. I'm about halfway through, um, eh, maybe a little bit, a little bit less than halfway through, but nice cigar. Go check it out. Hope you all enjoyed these. This one as, the, as well as can't talk towards the end of my video. Hope you've enjoyed this along with the other videos. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Don't forget to leave your comments and don't forget to share. And I hope y'all will see me soon. Oh, almost forgot my closing, which is cigar in mouth. Peace out. Ha <laughs> ha.